Hello everyone, and welcome to the stream, our Saturday stream that we do most every week, and we're continuing on with the U Testament, as of course you knew we would. Continuing on with Bully Demise's Gospel. Now what was it that we were doing last time with Bully Demise? We were relaxing, we were trying to find our place in the world, we remember we saw John the Baptist on the cross, dying for Bully Demise, as he wore a Bully Demise shirt, was obviously a very big fan. Well, we've gotten a lot of our health back, it seems, and a lot of our sanity. We still have a lot of bad karma, and we're gonna need to fix that if we want to use these miracles. Oh, and there's... There is one of our victims from last time. That Roman just seems to have it out for us. He's still coming this way. Well, as sad as it is, I'm sure all of this suffering and all of this weakening of the body has made her spirit very strong, indeed. So I guess we don't really need to be concerned about that. Let's move on. Same thing for this gentleman right here. He must have an extraordinarily strong spirit at this point. Let's see where is the next location Bully Demise needs to get to. Okay, there is an exit this way. Uh, let's see. Bethlehem, we're wanted there, it seems. And we don't want to go there anyway, because it seems that our objective... Let's see. Try heading this way. Yes, that's correct. Correct, Arturiax, someone who received our blessing. Yes, it is a blessing in disguise as... It, mm, no, still not there. As it hurts the body, but strengthens the spirit. And isn't that what's the most important part? Alright, let's head into Gehenna. Which is ominously named. Sounds like there are some insta-gib problems. There have been in past weeks when we first start the stream, but as we go on, they seem to clear up after a few minutes. So, let's see if things get better. Anyway, we're in Gehenna. Why are we here? What do we need to do here? Well, this is obviously not what we need to do. Get hassled by these Romans. Fine, fine, we'll drop the sword. Because, I mean, obviously, Bully Demise could take him on with the sword, or our fire powers, or the miracle of strength, which we learned last time. Or we could just put down the sword, say goodbye, and pick it back up. Alright, let's take a look around. Who are we supposed to talk to around here? Oh, there's a prisoner. There's someone in jail. Wonder if... Oh. Okay, I guess his I guess he served his sentence, but he is not who we need to speak to. Hmm, I don't see Jesus around here. It might not be him we're supposed to talk to. There might be someone else around. Like this apparently dead bully demise fan who is dead. Well, if he's who we have to talk to, we might be in trouble. Let me just see something. Oh. Well, the cross is no longer over Gehenna. It said we had to go here, but... Hmm. When I looked at that map before... Oh, no! It's still there on the map! Cross still shows up on Gehenna. So this is where we need to go. Huh. There must be someone around here who needs to speak with Bully Demise, or who Bully Demise... Look, Roman! We don't want any, any hassle from you! Please stop bothering Bully Demise. Oh, there's Jesus. He's locked up. Bully Demise is a man of peace, a man of the spirit, and Jesus is... seems like it's not going so well for him. Bully Demise knows all about being persecuted, being imprisoned for false charges. 
Oh, master, tax evasion? That, that, it's not worth going to jail over that. I mean, I, I've seen those posts you've been making on those libertarian message boards. But you gotta pay your taxes! Hmm, some money, you say? I wonder if I can manifest money, if that's what if that's what we could do, or if there's just money, a bag of money lying around. I don't see anything, so perhaps we just need to use our miracle powers to manifest some money. I mean, Jesus could do that himself. This is within his power, but I guess maybe he's testing us. And I could see the chat is quite a bit behind still, since I don't think anyone's acknowledged the presence of Jesus. It's just like when we were streaming on Twitch at the end, just about when we stopped doing that, and the chat... We're not going to be able to create your money if you keep hassling Bully Demise! Look, I think that the Romans don't quite understand what's going on here. Bully Demise has to get on the ground, he has to concentrate, and money will appear! We could use this money to pay the Romans! If they don't want the money, then fine. Interrupt Bully Demise. Go ahead... ...and see what happens. Anyway, yes, the chat... Okay, I think the chat has now finally seen Jesus. So they are quite behind. Hopefully, this rectifies itself as we go on. Okay. Well, if the Romans leave us alone... We, well, there's fire. We could try to free Jesus with fire, but I don't think that will work. I'm gonna guess at least that we should not take the dark path to free Jesus. Let's see if we can use that manifestation to create money. I'm still not entirely sure how we do it. But maybe we can give it a try. Okay, we ran out of bad karma here. We're building up good karma. Yes, Jesus believes in Bitcoin. He does not want his currency to go through any kind of corrupt government body. He wants a, a currency that he directly controls along with other common people. The government should have nothing to do with the money. Deregulation. It's in the Bible. It's right there somewhere. I'm sure M. Dickey could find the quote. Stay away from fiat currency. Somewhere in the Book of Mark, I'm gonna guess. Alright, we, we got a good amount of good karma right here. Now let's see. There's hypnosis. Let's try to get to the top of this tree. There's strength, and there's manifestation. That's the one we want. Oh, I can't see... You know, Bully Demise can only take so much of this. I'm trying to create money out of thin air. I'm trying to use the power of my soul to create money to pay you. You know what? No! We've got stuff to do! Look, I made an apple. That apple could have been gold. That could have been gold that I could have used to pay you. And now what? Now that kid took your whip. Did you see that? He just took it right from you. Maybe this will teach you. Maybe that will teach you a lesson about interfering with the work of the Holy One, Jesus is chosen. Let me pick this up. I'm gonna eat this right in front of you. That could have been yours. Could have been yours. Too late. It is too late now. And that guy might be dead. I think he is dead. I think Bully Demise has just killed him. And it looks like the chat did not witness this murder. They are attempting to get Instagib working, which apparently is not working for them at all. Well, at least they'll have a surprise in store once they get back and actually see what's happened. Look, if we try to meditate, I'm sure this guy is going to give us some hassle. 
Oh, hey, thanks. Well, maybe he's a good guy after all. Does does he want to you want to do something? Does he want to go? I think he wants to go. Or we could hug. I could say, you know, you got to calm down. You got to embrace peace and you have to embrace love. Bully Demise has embraced love. And he loves you with his fists. Uh-oh, we're under arrest. That could be a problem. Well, we were under arrest once before. <laughs> and we were found... This guy's pissed! He's angry over what's happened. We've been under arrest once before, and we were found guilty and sent to prison. Let's see how this goes this time. Sounds like there's a brawl going down going on down there. Some decorum, please. This is a legal proceeding. I don't think any jury would convict Bully Demise for murder. He obvious that Roman obviously had it coming. We'll see if we have a uh, a biased jury here. Oh, we, the other the other accused is also a Bully Demise fan. <laughs> <laughs> I think this playthrough was made worthwhile from from that, no matter how this goes. Oh, it looks like we're found guilty. And oh yeah, that might guy might be dead anyway. He seems completely out of it. I don't know what happened to him. I'm, I'm gonna be crucified, oh no! Bully Demise, facing the same, same fate as John the Baptist. How did things come to this? Bully Demise wonders how his life has just spiraled out of control, and Bully Demise finds himself on the cross, slowly dying. Oh wait, Jesus is here too? And he, is, he has converted. Jesus is now also a Bully Demise fan. In the end, even the Son of God came around. An arrow in a bow. Or foot in a boot. It has to be stomped at just the right time. Oh. oh Jesus, no. The king of the Jews has passed. And is there any fate that Bully Demise... Anything Bully Demise could do to escape a similar fate. As we hang on the cross, our life ebbing away from us. And lo, just as Bully Demise learned the lessons from Jesus, learned these miracles, learned the path to God, Bully Demise was fated to die alongside Jesus on the cross. This game was made in three months? Oh, really? Only three months, M. Dickey? So, uh, according to M. Dickey, all of the previous games have, have le led up to this, led up to the U Testament. Each of his previous games have have helped with some aspect of the U Testament. This was the main product, what everything was leading up to. 
It's just a shame that Jesus clearly had many more miracles to teach us, but we never got to that point. We never got to the point where we could fill out that tree and learn how to truly be a man of God. It is accomplished. <laughs> yes, it certainly was, M. Dickey. You, you accomplished a thing here. I'm not sure what that thing is, but it it's something that I think anyone who, who sees or plays the U Testament will always remember it. It's not the kind of thing that you forget anytime soon. You know, you see a lot of independent games that are made that are kind of forgettable. You know, you played for a few minutes and, you know, you don't really think anything of it. The U Testament is something I think that will stick with us to the end of our lives. And Bully Demise's life ended too soon. Unfortunately, well, but we never really knew why Bully Demise was here in the first place. Last, last we saw of him, he was in jail in the present day. He died there and ended up here. Is this really the end of Bully Demise? Can it be the end of Bully Demise? Or is Bully Demise fated for something more, something greater? I guess we don't know for right now. We won't know how any of this really fits into the life of Bully Demise. Was there a reason? Was there a cause for all of it? Who can say? All I can say is that that's it for the U Testament, at least for right now, I suppose. Did we solve all of the biblical religious mysteries? I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll have to find out some other time, because that's it for right now. That's it for right now. Bully Demise dying in defense of Jesus Christ as he attempted to access his chakra to generate the money to use to pay Jesus' bail because Jesus apparently is a libertarian who does not believe in paying the taxes. We can all learn from this. I'll see you back here in a few minutes, hopefully without the laugh.